Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 999 Gaming. Wanted to post a quick video from the upcoming game Dawn of Titans. This video shows you the campaign quest and the first boss fight, which is Orc Luck. You can see I pulled up the retreat button, which you don't want to do, so I canceled that. It's an instant loss. Uh, this is kind of like the pre-game, so you get to strategically place your troops. As I mentioned, I think in the last video, you can use the cursor, the little cross button, to drag your troops forward. So you don't have to do all this running with the archers that I'm doing. This was one of my first couple days playing the game, so it did take a little while to get used to the mechanics of the battle. You can see I'm pulling those archers, and the problem with that is, is as you're pulling the archers, they're not going to fire and run, so they have to get in position. So I charge in with my Titan. Uh, Wolven goes in and engages a set of troops. You can see there's another group of undead at the upper right corner. And then several more spawn out. So we knew this was going to be a, a, a pretty hectic battle because of it's a boss fight. So obviously there's going to be a, a few more troops there. Right now my archers are pretty well protected, but they're not in the best place. You can see from a flanking side there's some undead coming over on the right. And you always want something to be in front of your archers to sort of protect them. And you're going to see how bad my placement is in a minute when we actually fight the boss. You can see Orclick drops down right in the middle. Uh, it's just going to decimate my archers. I try to pull troops back to uh, engage him and then move the archers a little bit to the right. But this is wasted time. If the archers were in a better position, they would be firing right away. Even still this point in the game you do have more troops than than he does so ultimately it's going to come down and be a victory so not bad early on in the game uh, kind of figuring out the fighting mechanics and you get a total victory and the spoils of war you get a little bit of experience points a little bit of the experience points some gold and also a new relic which is a warp stone you'll be able to go into manage relics and see exactly what that is we're going to go ahead and continue uh, you can see I did not make it above the 85 percent line so those troops were all destroyed the island disappears and the next campaign will surface so the storyline just continues to, to get deeper and deeper. There's the completed quest. And there's your first boss fight. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for more videos. And subscribe below for more updates.